You guys, you found part six of Dish Palooza. So many dishes in this vintage haul. Also, when I saw this in the box in part one, I'm telling you the story of how a rock hit my kid's head when he was 10. If you're following the story, he's in the second ER with his second CT scan. These dishes came from someone who liked to collect for mosaics, but oh my gosh, so many fun eras represented. And she found some lookers. Got the Corel ware, some bone china, some modern plates, and this one that I cannot read. Also, we have a pretty large kitchen, but I resorted to putting dish piles on the floor. It's so hard to describe what it was like to process him laying there on the gurney and us not knowing what was going to happen. When the on-call neurosurgeon came in, he said he was talking with the head guy, you know, neurosurgery guy. You guys, she was doing a mosaic project. They said the tolerance was one millimeter. He was one millimeter away from brain surgery. You guys know how small a millimeter is? If you've ever been through a situation like that as a parent or as a human being, you know that you're just out of control. There's nothing you can do. Well, I'm liking these. Even though my son was clearly not himself, they checked him in the hospital and they said, let's wait and see. If you've ever had a concussion, you know brain trauma, it is no small thing. They called his injury a mild to medium traumatic brain injury. Now that's some patina. Also, I do have a lot of saucers with no teacups, so yeah, we're gonna need to figure out some projects. The police visited us at the hospital to try to figure out what's going on, but yeah, you're gonna have to go to part seven because we're done with this box.